Hello, greetings even. Um, I'm tired. Oh wait, shit. Alexa, mark my take meds reminder is completed. Okay, I'll I forgot to take my meds. So we're taking them now. I'll make sure I actually remember to mark this off in my notebook. I have a notebook to track when I take my meds so I don't forget what meds I've taken. I've got the estrogen dissolving in my mouth right now. And then I got the rest of my meds too. We got um some of Aldi's energy drinks. We got a yeah. Uh or I've got one of them. I guess I shouldn't say some. That implies I'm like drinking multiple. No, I only have one. I have slowly had them all throughout the course of the week. I think it's been more than a week. You would like, yeah, it, I actually have a monster in there, but I'm not drinking it right now. It's a monster from like weeks and weeks ago. I just haven't had yet. I'm curious. Um, I'm trying to see if, uh, dang, I thought someone texted me and asked where I got the stuff from. Whatever. Folks are doing well today. Uh, yeah. Also, welcome, Redbox. But yeah, I think everyone's doing okay. Uh, let's pop in. We just... Oh. <laughs> Med's taken. It'll hopefully be a little bit more energetic now that I've taken... Or, like, at least later I'll be more energetic because I took the vitamins. Oh, right. We, need, we never used the peddler satchel, did we? have to murder the fucking yeah we do need to murder the traveling merchant fucking you know what fuck it we're just we are just shredding the slime rain right now normally it would just go to the abomination and just have him remove something like this no Th this is personal you're not st I'm not starting the stream with a slime rain and just not gonna fucking murder everything. But yeah, so today's gonna be probably primarily building the uh, the basic design for the mega build that we're doing. That we're doing. If you weren't here yesterday, we are starting the uh, gallery. It's gonna be a gallery of every single vanilla terraria item, separated into uh, I think it was seven different categories. I have a note. I have a little scuffed drawing in my notebook of it. Cool. Yeah. Fuck you. Uh, awesome. 
Yeah, let me actually go check my notebook. Let me move my energy drink over there so I don't lose it. Yeah. Weapons and ammo, tools, armor, accessories, vanity, blocks and furniture, and miscellaneous, which is just anything else in the item idealist that couldn't fit into any of those. Um, underground pipe. Can you think of this town a name? This is one of our, like, almost completed towns. I'll think of a name for it later. Why are there slimes in the background? Slime rain. Slimes are literally falling from the sky. I think that I have Geltic wings on this character now. All right. Oh, great. The fucking nymph. Oh, fuck you. Great. No, I saw a battle cry on. Oh my God, I saw a battle cry on. I saw a battle cry on. That would explain that. Yep. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah, no problem. All right. Well, that whole debacle's been fixed. Uh, we need to make 27 rows of this. So, I guess nothing left to do but get to work. Uh, you guys didn't know we got a new drill um, during last stream as well. It, it, it's nothing too, like, special. It's got the pickaxe power of a mithril drill, but the speed of a palladium drill because of uh, the fact that uh, cause of the drill bug that plagues Terraria. So it's slower than it should be, but that just makes it the same speed as a palladium, as a palladium drill. I literally just did it to match our new spear. Uh, the dragon's talon. Okay. Yeah, it's like we, we we got time. We can mine this all kind of by hand right now. I don't really mind too much. The nice thing is that we're so close to the underground pylon, we have access to our uh, to our storage. Like say, if I want to change the music, which I actually kind of do. We'll do brimstone crags. Who dareth ping me? No. Oh. Okay. Ghost ping in a server. Right. I think we're gonna start off by getting this sort of uh, thing going. Yeah, so I calculated this and it should be exactly 486, which is uh, 27 rows of 18. Because I know we did the math last stream. Or I guess uh, the calculator did the math. I, 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 I can't math anymore. I could math all the way through like middle school and then like the first half of freshman year and then as soon as trigonometry got introduced, I, I froze and then I hated math after that. But yeah, it's nice because we can do this exact same thing for armor and accessories. We just replace the item frame with a, uh, uh, what's it called? With a mannequin, right? I think the only one that's gonna be different is gonna be blocks and furniture. So blocks and furniture is the only one that's going to have a different layout than this. That means that this shouldn't be like, I guess, difficult. Okay, uh, you know what's also really funny? Um, if you guys weren't here yesterday, um, I got a new outfit for Asphodine, uh, just like while vibing because we had a bunch of stellar fragments left over, right? And I specifically said, 
this is like the this is like something I would wear if I didn't have like a whole bunch of fucking sensory issues. Well, I'm going out door dashing night, so I like legitimately dressed up in something similar to that. I just ended up uh, I was in a pair of shorts and I ended up taking those off and switching them out for jeans because it's still apparently not uh, short weather. My brains are, shut up. Uh, but yeah, nah, s similar vibe. Um, I just ended up replacing the shorts I was wearing for jeans because, uh, I didn't realize it's still only 60 degrees out where I live. So, very fun. Oh yeah, it does. There's actually, uh, there's actually armor sets we can get. Uh, the first one is, uh, post-mech. So we're coming up on getting armor sets soon. But yeah, of course, it, it's a mod... Bungie, it's a mob with a bunch of anime women in it. Why would it not be? Why would it not have dress up included? Why would it not have dress up? Oh, Vein Miner still feels so nice. Oh, that feels good. Oh, that feels good. Like. Yeah, I mean, Bungie, we've been wearing a different outfit the entire time. Like, you see, like, this is what Aspidine's, like, normal outfit is. We just have this, which is, uh, Seven Sigils Autumn. I don't understand why it's an autumn outfit. Like, <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Chat, chat, is she, chat, is, is she psychic? Is she psychic? Wait a minute. Chat? Chat? Well then. Oh, shut up. Maybe I'm not wearing shoes. Okay, okay. She, he, she lost me. She lost me. She's not psychic. Just a really lucky guess. I am currently not wearing shoes. I just have socks. Or maybe she doesn't like the fact I have Converse. I've got a pair of uh, Converse that I like barely ever wear out. But I'm like, I might as well not wear the dingy running shoes I've been wearing for like three years now, like three, four years now. I'll wear the Converse I never wear because they look better. Uh, so I'm going to be wearing those out when I go out and like do a job that isn't YouTube. But like, Asphodine is psychic. Hi, Kyle. Asphodine is either psychic and doesn't hate that I have a that I have a Converse next to me that I'm gonna be wearing later, or she just made a really lucky guess. Realistically, it's just an entire coincidence, but I like to think it's not because it's really funny. Also, I'm glad that even with my own texture pack, like I made these textures and I'm still getting palladium and uh, copper confused. What we just mined up was, co uh, was copper. Over here is palladium. What am I building now? A gallery of every single item in the vanilla game. Because of course I am. Because I am apparently addicted to building massive structures. I'm just gonna replace that. It's probably faster. Would have been faster if I, you know, built like quickly. Yeah, wait. Wait. Bungie, I don't think either of them are edible. Is there something you need to tell me? Yeah, uh, but to be fair, I don't plan on just only doing this. I plan on, uh, I, I plan on, you know, uh, spreading this one out. 
Like this month, I more want to focus on getting the structure down, getting the structure down and having slots for all the items. Collecting the items could be something that'll take a bit longer. <coughs> and luckily with uh, with mods like Fargo and uh, Calamity 2, we can uh, get items much faster. Hey, Bungie, Bungie. Wait, yeah, wait, yeah, you do play Stardew. You, you know exactly what I'm about, you know exactly the joke I'm about to make. You play Stardew. I, get, I need to try Stardew again. I'm, I have, I tried Stardew like years ago, but yeah. Hi, Jade. What do I mean by that? You, do you know Abigail from uh, the popular video game, the, the Stardew Valley? Why is there mud randomly here? Like this is the weirdest spot to have just mud blocks. never eat rocks. I never said you, I said Abigail from popular video game Stardew Valley. There's something really funny about uh about knock about the uh the knockoff crimson tool or the knockoff uh, corruption tools getting a knockoff version of curse flames. It's also a knockoff version of Icor, but it's kind of funny because I have I have I have the bile um, uh, flask, which gives uh, essentially a mixture of uh, Icor and Curse Flames, kind of. Not really, but kind of. I believe it's just kind of a two for one special on them that's slightly worse in both directions. But I mean, you're still getting both. Is there anything good? Not really. Yes, the items are going to be in alphabetical order. Um. But yeah. Um. And then drag. Uh. The dragon equipment is. Uh the thorium's version of like cursed flame tools like uh like uh po popular youtuber and discord connoisseur uh, cursed flames from uh every single terraria discord to ever exist this is a great assignment oh no very scary very scary uh it's gonna be a little bit weird um, how I'm gonna do it with, like the other ones. Like um, I was able to do it here because there actually is an alphabetical list of all of the weapons. Um, but like there isn't one for ammo. There isn't one for armor. There's really only one for this. So for those, I'm probably gonna go by ID, by ID number. Oh yeah, Curse Flames. Yes, Curse Flames is everywhere. I literally share like 30 servers with Curse Flames or something like that. Yeah, wait, how, how many servers do I share with Curse Flames? How many servers do I share with you? Okay, I only share like five, shut up. I just, I know he's in an absurd amount of Terraria servers. I could have sworn I shared more with him at one point. I did, I did leave a bunch of my servers. I did leave a bunch of servers a few months ago. That could partially be why. Still, he is literally everywhere.
That is more than four. You know, it's becoming harder and harder to fight off the terror tuber allegations. Like I, I, I'm like thinking, right? Uh, I guess like kind of like what to say. And I was reminded of um, I I posted my new profile picture in Thorben's Discord the other day, right? And I'm like, I, I actually really like this. Um, I think the only thing I'm I might change later is uh the plume because I don't know really how I want to present it. Someone suggested adding in harpy feathers because I do terraria content. Um. Which was very fun, as uh, as someone who is busy fighting off Terra Tuber allegations, despite the fact she, li despite the fact she literally streams 40 hours of Terraria a month and then makes monthly videos on Terraria, and hasn't posted a Souls video like she said she was going to in like literal months, despite the fact that she has like three videos in production that she just keeps procrastinating because. Pat, what you think you you think you can you think you have executive function? No, you have executive dysfunction. I love being neurodivergent. It doesn't hurt me whatsoever. Totally. Autism is a superpower, motherfuckers, when I literally cannot get myself to move for like entire days. Where's that superpower now, bitch? Look, you put dozens of hours in dozens, dozens, and no, no, because if I become a tur if I become a Terra Tuber, the exact thing that happened the last time it was a Terra Tuber happened, where I'm gonna do nothing but make Terraria content for three years straight, and it's going to literally ruin my mental health. And then I'm gonna uh, try to quit YouTube because it's literally destroying my mental state. I realize that I'm too addicted to making content for some reason. And then come back. Telling myself I won't fall into the trap of being a TerraTuber again. And then I go ahead and I make a very long series where I play through, uh, you know, the entire game over the course of 500 hours. You're a goober. That's very mean. Bungie, I'm not saying being a terror tuber is bad. I'm just gonna bully you for being a terror tuber, even though there's nothing wrong with it. And like, see, there are some perks to being a terror tuber. I could uh, force myself into those like events that people do for clout. Whether or not I would enjoy it is um, entirely up to whether or not I actually give a shit about the people. <clears throat> like, someone like Thorbin would seem like nice enough, and then there's like fucking Duke Fish Run. Like, it kind of, it kind of, it, it entirely comes down to who the hell I'd be like, uh, like in the event with. Love the juggernaut vampiric fly. Why are there flies over here? Fuck off. Wait, Halo One Lasso. Ah, uh, no. Uh, no. I'll do Halo Two Lasso. Like, uh, like that one time uh, we did fucking Halo Two Legendary on stream, like literal months ago. Right. Um. I would not want to play the library for 8 billion hours. I I'm going to be honest, I'm good. 
I think I'm okay with not playing the uh, with not playing the library for that long. Young and never again, L. You know what? Chat, I might be stupid. It has been 20 minutes and I never changed. Uh, I never changed over the, um, the scene for Twitch. Uh, Twitch is now going to ban me because it's not the exact same experience. Though to be fair, Twitch could ban me for any one of my streams. Uh, because one, I'm using combined chat. Um, which kind of cringe that they don't allow combined chat technically. Uh, they also don't like allow alert because that's considered advertising your other platforms. Uh, but who gives a shit? Um, and then I also, I don't give the same experience because I take advantage of higher bit rates on YouTube to stream at 12k instead of 6k. So I have a better stream bit rate because I stream in 2k on uh, YouTube compared to 1080p on Twitch. Because Twitch doesn't let you go any higher than 6k without it kind of breaking. Yeah, very strange and weird and cringe. Imagine what, like, imagine how grand this is gonna look when it's done. This is gonna go up so high, I swear to God. I completely underestimated how large 27 layers this is, uh, like, actually is. But it's fine. This is fine. Get this pearl stone cleared out. Yeah, I am being. Yeah, I am. Uh, I am clearly favoring YouTube over Twitch. To be fair, Twitch is cool and all, but um, if, if I had to choose one, I'm choosing YouTube. I'm gonna be honest. If I had to choose a streaming platform, I'm choosing YouTube. YouTube, I uh, just, it, I get too many advantages from streaming on YouTube when compared to Twitch. Like I don't have to upload VODs. Uh, I can stream at higher quality. Uh, most of my viewership is on YouTube. And like, I'm already making videos on there. But I don't really see too much of a reason. to if I have to select between them why I wouldn't pick YouTube I don't, I don't have like a good reason as to why I wouldn't yeah your move twitch yeah they don't give a shit about me anyway I don't make them enough money To be fair, that is entirely what I am. I'm just, I, you see, Twitch is Twitch. I'm a bitch, but I'm not a Twitch bitch. I'm a YouTube bitch. Oh my God, the amount of bats. God damn it. You know, we haven't seen any royal enemies yet. 
they're like larger than uh than like swarming and juggernaut enemies and then they spawn smaller enemies while they're uh, uh when they get attacked but they give like massively increased money oh these things have mutant nibble ew i hate that oh fuck off i hate mutant nibble so much Are you making bridges? No, I am not making bridges, Bungie. Hey, Bungie, have you ever heard of a platform? Have you ever heard of a platform in popular video game Terraria? Or I, I'm sorry, popular video game Calamity, because as we all know, the um, because as, as we all know, uh, Calamity is the only thing that takes any sort of precedence here takes any sort of like uh i don't know uh b b b basically um as we all know calamity is the only mod i'm playing i'm not playing with 89 other mods on top of it including like six like including six other mods i would consider to be major content mods i mean kind of five um Consolari is a little bit weird, but I kind of grandfathered it in since I use it in all my playthroughs. And also, I feel like, especially Okram, I feel like Okram tier can change up everything so much. Uh, in terms of like progression, because even when it got moved to post Plantera, it was still pretty good. Also, what adds in is like a lot of extra small miscellaneous content. Oh, hell no! Oh my god, no. Like, Calamity and Thorium both will, like, like, both are, like, the same size as Vanilla Terraria itself. Not to mention all the other mods, like Catalyst, Mod of Redemption, all of that jazz. I could just put the mop in a, uh, I could just put the mop in a single, um, uh, and it's in its own little area and then that would be everything for overhaul so I can do overhaul it's fine I can do overhaul just fine build a mop shrine <laughs> especially since i haven't been using the mop lately the mop is kind of retired just being you know like a god i love alt tabbing and just having everything just freeze because you made the weird decision to alt tab while playing popular video game terraria uh for the i don't know google stadia actually i'm curious you know what? i'm curious Right! I forgot about that! I forgot Terraria on Stadia got cancelled! Was curious if they had it! Uh, back when Stadia was like a thing, but no, I forgot they cancelled Terraria on Stadia. Honestly, good on red, Stadia's horrible. From what I know of, Stadia kinda sucks. Watch, I'm gonna get like all the fucking Stadia apologies going, yeah, why you that bad? Shut up, no it was. It, it, it was. Look me dead in the eyes and tell me that Stadia was a good console. And like, mean it. All the three people that play on Stadia casually finding my channel at the same time. Okay. Cool, so after this I need to go and need to build up a bit more.
You know, I was thinking, I was thinking like I might use city busters. I'm, I'm probably not gonna use city busters. Okay. I just wanna kinda chuck a galactic reformer somewhere. Just like for fun, you know? Cause like for fun, just like throw a galactic reformer somewhere. What, like 600 by 600? We can blow up this, uh, this thriving ecosystem over here. The area should be probably like about like this large or so. Oh, hey, Travs. Hey, buddy. Um... Let me just blink. I need you for later. man's chest. Yay, we're gonna go blow up an ecosystem. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna, just cause this is so large, I'm gonna fact check myself on this being like 600 by 600. Yes, 600 blocks, okay. Got it, so this shouldn't? destroy anything that actually matters it'll just destroy the thriving ecosystems because who cares about those oh hey mechanical skull oh we have another one already damn i was unaware of that i want to go probably to right about here and then we're gonna chuck it there yay we're gonna go blow up and in <laughs> we're gonna go blow up a Uh, 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 I can't speak. We're gonna blow a bunch of like natural underground stuff. <coughs> it's nice too, because despite the fact this is the larger explosion than uh, uh than what's it called? Yay! Hi, Longbeard. Despite the fact that this is a larger explosion than the nuke, the tree nymph won't get mad at me for this one. She only gets mad because, you know, she's like scripted to get mad at you if you, uh, if you nuke the world like we did back in the beginning of April. But she's not scripted to get mad at you. Like. Okay, I'm going to save and exit really quick. I'm uh, not trusting this. I'm not trusting that this won't crash my game. We gotta get the summons out for this one. Two. One. I just slept just the. Got spanked by Rachel's nuke. Wait, I need that. I need that. I need that image. I'm just gonna, you know what, Bungie, you get a, you 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 get the image. 
<laughs> oh my god, the just the destruction. I need to put uh, I'm gonna put this one in just my personal DMs. <laughs> we have a hole on the map now. That's incredible. Oh, I love destroying random things for fun. You see, that's the that's the cool part. I don't. I could just leave it there as a whole. I could just leave this here. Would this be a significantly better spot to build the gallery than over here? Yes. I'm not going to though. It's just really funny to just have a large hole. Just really funny to have this like just a large hole right here. <laughs> yeah, build a fucking Waffle House. Yeah, you're so right. You're like so right. Not right now, because we have work to get done, but yes. Oh boy. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay. This is uh, just about a fifth of the way. So we're going to go up very high. Yeah. Probably going to be the most successful business in the entire world. Oh god, that's a mimic. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Not so menacing now, huh, menacing mimic? Bitch. Look, so I like, I know this is like just the harvest moon and all that, but like, I like to think of it as just being the, uh, being, you know, just the glow of an explosion because I fucking nuked part of the world. I am very funny. Yeah, but I went into the, uh, I went into the, uh, what's it called? Um, uh, I went back to the wiki to go look up, uh, how large the city busters are. And I forgot about the universal collabs. 100 platinum. Okay. Wait, how large is this? Oh, actually, if I sit like right here, like I guess it's like a little bit farther over. Okay, what if we went like right here? We chuck the city buster right here. City busters are the bottom center. So if I do this right, Let's uh, get as many of these as we can. Boom. Yoink. 
Oh, that shouldn't have hung right there, but it's fine. Love that. Mmm. Love that beautiful, beautiful noise. Yeah, so it's like... It's like literally like just like right here. Beautiful noise. Okay, that should hopefully be large enough. No, probably not. <laughs> probably not a ton left. Actually, this is a large world. I, I, I wouldn't count out. I wouldn't count it all out just yet. But mindless destruction is pretty fun. To be fair, mindless destruction is pretty fun. Dig up on this one. Over on this block right here. Boom. Like, I don't know how many more large projects I really need to do. Like, there's probably something I could think of in the future, but like, I don't know. I'm, I'm not, you know, I'm not just going to blow up the entire underground just for shits and giggles. That's what the large hole is for. I got how nice city busters are to use. Oh, they are so helpful. I can't wait until next week. Uh, for context, next week we get access to Mithril and Aura, Cal uh, Aura Calcum. Uh, I took a poll. Uh, it was tied. And uh, so I get to pick. I, I, I get to be the cool, awesome tiebreaker. And uh, I say, yes, we're doing the new way of doing ores. Um, every week I unlock a new tier because if I do it the way the Calamity wants me to, we will literally not interact with... Uh, Especially the two middle tiers, or especially the two middle ores whatsoever. Because we're just going to go straight past it. Especially since we're switching the armor. Uh, especially since we're like, uh, since we're going straight to squire armor. Won't really be much time, really, I guess, like, interact with any of them. So there's gonna be, you know, it, it, it it's gonna be different. Uh, we're, we're gonna do funny things. I can't speak. It wasn't obvious. Okay. Okay, 
I had the common cry on. Oh my god. Let's dig down the next two blocks as well. Oh, fuck off. Okay, gotta go, don't die. I'll try. No guarantees, but I'll try. All my uh rip all my lamps <laughs> my lamps all of them are gone it's fine i can replace them i can replace the lamps pretty quickly although very sad no i'm gonna take these out of my inventory my void bag. Just gotta, just gotta build. Probably just up to here to start. So we'll see where we go from there. The issue with city busters is that whatever I don't uh, like use, I'm gonna end up just wanting to re. I'm, I'm gonna end up refilling because uh, it'll like, it'll like physically hurt not to. Like that'll be time consuming, but whatever. Let's go get the rest of this cleared off. Let's get rid of all of this. Ow, bitch, fuck off. Here, I'm 
just gonna go up one wing flight times worth. Fuck off, you stupid bats! Okay, it goes up higher than that, but this is good enough. Thank you so much for randomly teleporting me. I hate enemies. To like something like that just to, just hide up to where I won't need to worry about placing walls for a while it doesn't have to be perfect it just has to be good enough it's <laughs> sleepy fly Don't we need? Do I have a black spot? Shit, did not mean to do that. God damn it, I don't have a black spot. Wait, actually, I think the pirate probably sells it. Wait a minute. Where is he? I know I have the pirate. I did the invasion. Hello. Yes, thank you. Oh, thank you. Ah, oh, infinite flight. Oh, boy. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much, Infinite Flight. This is gonna help so much with like control. And just like general building. Oh, this feels nice.
Oh my god. I'm sorry, y'all don't know how nice it feels to finally have infinite flight for a large project like this. My spear as well. Just got a bit of a longer reach. But I don't have to get as close. in like I think it's like July is when we get the witch's broom oh my god this is gonna feel so nice it feels so good to have that just because it's it's infinite flight, but it's got even more control than this, and then you're also smaller when you have the witch's room on when compared to the like the black spot of the UFO. It's not gonna, you know, replace everything. It's, it's not gonna like, you know, replace my wings or anything anytime soon. And it probably won't even replace my mount, because I'm probably gonna keep on my uh well it'll probably be my unicorn eventually most of the time. Obviously, I don't have a unicorn right now. I don't even think I've run into a single unicorn enemy. What if there's a way I can craft it? Wait, right, it's not plus apple. Gastropod banner, that's such a weird... Okay, then. And then we need it for the supersonic soul anyway, so... Yeah, we're, we're, we're gonna go for it. So obviously it makes it so I need. Huh. Bit interesting that you can't use the goat. Uh, the, uh, the goat demon. It's just, uh, because they're literally the exact same stat-wise. One is just objectively cooler, and that's the unicorn. Actually, instead of even using my uh, my spear, I could just keep my bow or my repeater on hand. Yeah, it's like. This just lets me keep my distance if anything pops up. Allowing me to safely attack it while not, you know, getting myself fucking murdered. Oh, but let me also make sure I get you back out. Make sure there's no Dorals or, uh, yep, there are Dorals in here. And there's probably Vanquisher medals too that I forgot to put away.
I love building solid straight lines going up. This is only gonna be like, like six or seven rows, but that's whatever. <clears throat> it still gets us about halfway through and that'll give us a good, uh, I guess, way to gauge about how much more we're gonna need or space we're gonna end up needing. I'll be happy if we like even just get the uh if we even just get the weapons room done today. Because like that includes getting everything named, which is going to be a very long process of going through and naming every single item in the game. That includes things like fact checking items to make sure they're on certain lists. I just want to make sure it's like considered a weapon by the game standards because I'm going by um what well, the Terraria wiki considers a melee magic range or summon weapon not what they uh so not when the like the list of weapons includes things like tools well I'm only going off of what they consider to be a melee magic summoner or ranged weapon everything else will go into either tools or the miscellaneous section The cool thing about this too is I think we have uh, enough room. Just kind of yeah, we can we can just sort of get through here pretty easily. But only have to get off the ship to move around. All right, let me uh. Because there really shouldn't be any more water. No, you're kidding me. Now we have to stop everything. We have to go back. Where did this meteor land? I'm not just gonna let it break. I'm not just gonna let my my thing like break down. Do we have a count of how many item frames you'll, you'll be placing? Uh, it's the 486 for just the weapons category. Okay, let me use the map. Just to quickly update it. Where are we looking at the explosion? Wait. A meteor landed though. Did we luck out? Did it just not hit anything? Wait, no, did it hit all the way over on the right side? Probably made the, the black spot just so freaking slow. Sky bridge time. I think it literally uh, got destroyed all the way over here. Incredible. It's like using the pylons or the teleporters cool at all, but there's just there's something so awesome about just using the sky ridge we spent literally over an entire month building. It's should it go down before I got here? Not really. Oh shit, I always I forgot to turn on live chat. I was only on uh top chat. So I might have missed a few messages. Um meteorite. 
we're figuring out where it crashed doing just good old-fashioned maintenance other than that not too much has happened no it didn't that's just the normal fall off Did we seriously just luck out? I mean, I guess only one way to find out. We go over the other side. There's a meteorite hit. Like a meteorite just touched down. And I'm assuming it should have hit some. I see it. I found it. I found it. It's always on the supports too. So I always have to spend so much time rebuilding the supports. Found where the meteorite landed. Shouldn't be too hard to patch it back up. It does kind of suck though. But hey, that's what the canopy's for. The lessen the impact so that even if a meteorite touches down, at least this isn't out of commission. And it makes it it makes it so it's not too difficult to just go back over and take care of the meteor. Nice, clean 107 kilometers an hour. Oh boy. Also, I love, uh, I, I love the, uh, the back of my bandana flying in the wind. That's very cool. You can jump. I'm pretty sure you can jump right there and you can just uh, get yourself hit. Or you can just, like, get yourself trapped up here. Uh, I mean, it's not really trapped, but like, you get what I mean. What kind of planetoids up here? Oh, I didn't even notice. Some of the planetoids got uh, corrupted or hollowed. Oh. Huh, that's neat. Too bad I don't inherently care. Oh, thank God for the hallow. Oh, thank God for that. I should have got a mining chest plate. Nice. Oh, you're kidding me. I like my buffs, thank you very much. Shit, we already passed it. I was busy looking at other stuff. I missed my stop. Let's go back. Got my repeater out in case something pops up. I'm actually very proud of this repeater texture. I was a little bit worried about how, like, because I'm not very good at repeaters, but I'm actually pretty proud of this one. Uh, as well as the other ones I've had to redo. Okay. Hello. Just doing good old fashioned routine maintenance. Let's change the, uh, We'll do the hallow. I really like the remixed hallow theme. Oh, fuck off. brick yeah okay I, I I got it right there we go I 
it could. But I mean, it, it's not like the end of the world. I, I joke about it, but I really don't mind rebuilding parts of this. Could I? Sure. And if it becomes that much of an issue, I, I definitely could. But it, it's, I don't find it enough of, I guess, like a pressing matter to really bother. Like, it, it, it's just taking some quick little time to fix up the meteor. Or to fix up where the meteor hit. patched up. All patched up and nice and better. Like, make some more? Bungie, aren't you, like, the biggest... Aren't you, like, the biggest advocate right now for me to stop building bridges? Oh, I think that's an armor. I think that's a thing I don't have yet. We'll make some... We'll, we'll, we'll grab some portal blocks. Just a few of them. Fucking okay, Jevil. Jevil. Okay, there we go. We've replaced all the lights. We just need to fix up where... Shit, wrong walls. I'm gonna be honest, it is so nice finally being in hard mode. Ow! Leave me alone, I am trying to build! Oh 
grew off. You piece of furniture garbage. Fuck off. Yeah, Fargo mimics moment. I literally have the common cry on. It is so absurd. Probably shouldn't have made 1500 signs. It's fine though. Oh my god, fuck off. Fuck off. Yeah, that's right. I'm, yeah, okay, I'm going back. We don't need more mimics in this game, actually. We actually really don't need more mimics. I'm gonna be honest. Oh, fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Your shark run piece of shit. Like, this is with the common cry. Oh my god, there are so many of these shit. Like, are you guys seeing this? Like, I'm not the only person who thinks these spawn rates are absurd, right? Christ, I didn't think I'd have to go, like... Of pink torches, like 50 of them. No pink torches. Oh, my out of builder combos as well. I don't want to be damned little fish either, but it's fine. Nibble by that mod of redemption portal. I don't think so, though. It's because it's 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 I, it's not a conflict. It's it's working as intended. Just the working as intended is bullshit. Because uh, both eternity mode and uh, revengeance increase spawn rates. And from what I can tell, that's probably not one of the things Fargo touched when he was making his DLC mod. You're kidding me. Fuck off. Ugh. Actually, I don't even know if I used the fucking demon trophy. I might have actually. Still, though, this isn't just a. 
here's the thing. Even if I did, this isn't just a... This isn't just a hard mode thing. This is a pre-hard mode thing as well. This was happening in pre-hard mode. The demon trophy doesn't even fucking exist. Yeah, no, Revenge just has inherently higher spawn rate. Mimic stuff, talk to Longbeard. Longbeard, what the fuck happened? What kind of uh, dumbass story is Bungie talking about? Ew, what? No, I, I, I don't want to hear more. I don't want to hear more. I don't want to hear more. Forget I said anything. <laughs> Uh, I love losing all my buffs. I love losing all my buffs. I love purified. I love purified Chad, don't we just love purified? Don't we just love purified so much? Did I at least make another Supreme Deathbringer Fairy? No, I can't even make it to another Supreme Deathbringer Fairy. Ugh, I hate purified. It's such a shitty debuff. What gives me immunity to purified? Right, I need to make sure I open up my inventory whenever I do this. I know what I must do. Chat, we're killing jungle mimics. We're killing jungle mimics to settle a fucking... To settle, like, a, a, a super petty thing. Okay. Where is this fucking chest? Jungle chest. Oh, are these things only... Okay, these things are only craftable. Or, like, farmable. Got it. Cool. We're going to the jungle. What do you mean Longbeard wins again? Longbeard didn't win. Longbeard didn't win anything. I don't want to hear it. Not right now, bitch. Ugh. All right. Now we now we wait for jungle mimics. Let's get a. Uh... Right, maybe not this many. May maybe not this much. Maybe not this much. This was a bad idea. Make sure... Actually, I'll also go like this. Let's get our sentries down. Let's get our wave dancer up. Yeah, good thing we already have this. I'm not sure if it'll be large enough, but... Thank God we have something. Okay, jungle mimic. I see jungle mimic. Jungle Mimic is on my screen. Okay.
Did it just teleport away? No, okay, it didn't. Something else teleported. I got very worried. <sighs> I don't think we got what we were looking for, but now we can just buy the spawners and then we can use the mega arena if we really need. Delicacy. Bungie, what happened? Lol. Yay. I am just barely alive. Wait, 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 wait. Can I make it to the nurse in time? Okay, I'm still asking you to explain. Thanks. Note to self, red potions don't work in eternity mode. This is very sad. You're kidding me. Where's but where's my fucking actuator rod? Right, it's in my piggy bank. There you go. What do you mean plot convenience the drink? But you can't just say something vague. What is me milk? <laughs> Not an excuse. That's a tiny jungle mimic. Wait, why do I even bother buffing? Oh, that's a lot of wandering eyes. Oof. Ow. Oh, fuck off. No. What does that mean? Great, now we gotta find another one of these shit. Okay, but what is it? You can't just say it's whatever the whatever the plot needs it to be. I want a description of what min milk is. I can tell that it's mimic milk, but what the fuck does that mean? As far as I can tell, mimics are not animals. They're not animals, they're not mammals. It's 
so you can't milk a mimic. Mimics are not mammals. Do you see any hair on that thing? Oh, great. It just fucking dodged the attack. You're so awesome, aren't you? What do you mean I could have hair if I really wanted? Assuming you're going off of like a standard chest or going off like a standard D&D mimic, which mimics like standard household objects and whatnot, like the chests and barrels and things like that. It doesn't have hair. Got the triple charm. What do you mean? <laughs> I need to be more creative. I just don't understand. Shit, we just got a better pod zero two, didn't we? I think it might finally be time to put up the pod zero two. Did I? I did not mean to shout in here. Hello, entire jungle mimic. What do you mean a natural anomaly? Where is the milk stored? Where is the milk stored? How, how is the milk stored? How, how do you milk a mimic? Like make it make sense. <laughs> what? Mimics don't have milk sacks! What do you mean, ask it nicely? You guys make no sense! Okay, on an entirely different topic right now, um, the pod zero two, uh, the pod zero forty two has finally gotten, finally outlived its usefulness. Let's all get an F in the chat for the pod zero forty two. It has served us well, but now we have the fucking jungle mimic. Yeah, into the item frame it goes. It literally lasted us like an entire month. Okay, let's go get this mimic summon to uh, ruthless. Or not ruthless, uh, to mythical. Hell yeah, murderous. Thank you. That's totally what I wanted. I just I don't want to see the. Uh, I know I technically already had the best reforge on it, but I I I hate seeing. The, uh, I hate seeing the, the red numbers. I will gladly take the slightly less damage for this. Also, I'm going to get all this stuff to, to warding. The, te the teeth are on the other side. Do you know how confused I am? 
Like, I'm not, like, mad that you guys are, like, being weird as hell. Like, that's just par for the course. I know you guys. I, I know both my audience, my friends, and my friends' friends. But that's the thing. What am I learning about? What is the... I guess, but like, this is imply that there's like, mi there's like mimic farming. What is the ethics on that? Is there like laws in place? Is it like as like unethical as like cow farming, as like mil as like getting like cow's milk is? Or are they just like uh, forcefully impregnate? Uh, of female cows or in this case female mimics and then t take them away from their families and you know to force them to produce way more milk than they really should be able to like 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 is, is this like an actual like industry should i guess that's fair like should i be asking about this stuff hell no it's just, it's, it's interesting to think about. I don't know. The Mimic kind of slaps, though. I'm going to be honest. The Jungle Mimic kind of slaps, though. I will gladly take Mim Milk jokes. If it means I can have a Mimic running around murdering stuff. Very well deliberated symbiotic agreement. Bungie, Bungie, this is me we're talking about. YouTube gives me trouble with like all of my streams. Do you know how many times I like get my video, like I get my VODs demonetized as soon as they get re-rendered back into uh back into my channel? Like as soon as like uh YouTube renders them. <clears throat> like I, I'm only half joking at this, but like I, I'm starting to think YouTube might be a little bit transphobic. I'm starting to think YouTube might just not like trans people. To be fair, like jokes aside, they do push a lot of uh, right wing shit, but that's besides the point. That's just because they get all the money from them. Because fucking conservatives, I don't know. When the oil barons give you money, you'll say you hate trans people. I'll try not to get the stream super far down, though. I'll, 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 I'll try not to, like, bring down, like, the stream and whatnot. I will just play the funny block game. Yeah, 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 how would you feed, yeah, how would you feed them? Yeah, you know, you know, you know what? Honestly, I would rather talk about me milk in the, like, logistics of farming mimics for milk then talk about the uh then talk about real world transphobia would much rather talk about that yeah hell yeah trans rights fuck yeah you, you, you know what you, you know what you know what no i'm gonna take it a step further i support trans people in any direction upright Ups, rights, downs, or, or yes, ups, rights, downs, or lefts. I support trans people in any direction. Yes, I even support them in least. Trans dimensional. Oh, hello. Mimic fight. Mimic fight. Whichever one loses has to get milked.
know, I'd really rather not die right now. It's a pain in the ass to get back here. Well, I... I would... I would milk that Mimic, but that Mimic's now dead. So, um... Okay. Guess we're not milking any Mimics. Sorry, chat. You guys don't get to see me milk Mimics live on stream. Maybe we can capture a live Mimic, I'll milk it. Yeah, absolutely devastating loss. I don't know why, but like, it reminds, uh, this entire thing reminds me of like, uh, of like multiple different Doug Doug videos. Specifically, uh, the one, uh, the, the like six minute video on, I think, his Clips channel. Where it's just, um, uh, where it's just all of, uh, where it's just all of, like, chatters. Um, uh, saying a bunch of sexual stuff as Elden Ring characters. Just, like, entirely out of pocket. And then the video where Doug, uh, would give his viewers money if they could say a certain amount of normal messages in a row. And it was, like, a legitimate challenge. B right back right? Is that what that is? Uh, two really funny videos. Highly recommend. Bye. Right. Yes. I forgot. I just get like a million enemies spawning. And that was like why I got a whole bunch of peace candles. Do I still have these in my inventory? Do I have to go grab them now? Put down peace candles right over here and right over here. There. Help a little bit more with the spawn rates. They're gonna be so annoying. right back Rachel oh uh, yeah yeah I, I I guess so yeah it was a really late response is the latency bad for you guys or did it just take you that long to come up with be right back Rachel I guess we will just wait and find out and see if uh see how long it takes for this response Nazis mostly five. Well, yeah, I'm more asking about random. You can tell you when you're live or not. What do you mean? Like, I, I have live chat on. I get chat updates at the same time you guys do. You keep buffering. That would make sense. Because, like, I haven't really had any dropped frames or anything. Literally 0.6% of the stream has dropped frames. Which, sure, that's in the quadruple digits, but that's not really saying much when that's less than a percent. Hell, it's only 0.6% of the entire stream. 
After when you're streaming, I didn't realize it was 20 minutes behind because I didn't see a tiny red dot. Damn. Okay, so it's, uh... So, the video is more delayed than chat for you. Got it. Okay, how many layers up are we? I'm out of blood over here because I'm only enemies keep spawning. The me problem? That's fair. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. So yeah, I think we have enough room. Uh, we're gonna have to make more wall or we're gonna have to build more walls up, but I think we have like enough uh I like, just like enough like space. Oh boy, I didn't even realize how many weapons this is. Oh my god. I don't even think I ever like clicked just how much uh, how many weapons and ammo there are in this game like just the vanilla game yeah bridge building to the sequel and this one's gonna last multiple months <laughs> so i'm considering do we want to take it section by section i guess i mean like in terms of like building like the outline it's probably gonna be what we're, what we're gonna do yeah actually it probably actually never mind it's probably will be best to get um the general area built first have everything labeled and all of that so that when it comes to making uh so that we can just kind of place in any new items we get yeah this is something i definitely want to finish by uh the end of the year but like we aren't in any rush to so don't expect like every single stream to just be this I might devote like one stream a week to it. Yeah, I'll probably de devote like one stream a week or so to doing, uh, to working on the, uh, to working on the gallery and like in between, like, I guess like bridge build, er, yes, bridge building. Still have, uh, uh, to, to, still can't, I can't speak, whatever. Um, like in between like building like townhouses and stuff like that will be, working on this but like i'm not gonna force you guys to sit through it every single stream like the last ones i want to build other things you know like the mega builds are nice but there is also beauty in building smaller things you know there's beauty and simplicity it's why i hate things like block vomit or sorry texturing I, I've had this rant before, but it's it's it it's been a few months. Oh my god, I texturing. I don't know. I mm, texturing hurts my eyes. I don't like texturing, especially like when you just use like seven different blocks just for a wall. Yeah, like. Even just like this. Sure, it's using my custom textures, but like this looks weird. Like this looks weird to me. Or like uh, like going in and adding, I guess stone isn't as bad, but like I still don't like how it looks with stone. Where's my stone blocks? Like I still don't like how it looks with stone either. It's like, why? It, I don't like it. Like, I know I'm like alone in this assertion, but I don't like it. It looks, it, it, it just, it, it just, it looks like texturing for the sake of texturing. It feels overcomplicated and I don't like it. 
it, it's it's actually a lot of the same issues I have with Calamity sprites. They're over detailed and they're just needlessly noisy for the sake of it. They're too busy. There's too much going on. Scale it back. It will look so much better. Uh, well, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. That's different. Like, you know, having like lining on the bottom for like, say, you know, like with a lot of like simple houses to me, I'll do like a lining with whatever foundation block I use, which is usually either gray brick or stone slabs. Then I have the general wall. I have windows with maybe curtains, which would be two walls and then pillars, usually made out of wood, uh, usually made out of like uh, ebon wood or something. That's it. And that's for like entire houses. And they each serve a distinct purpose. Right, I wasn't supposed to make this yet. Like each of like each of these walls I have right here, like each of the walls I have in this build, they serve a distinct purpose. <coughs> With the gray brick being uh, the primary walling, the stone slabs being framing, and the gothic brick wall being support. It's all set up in a way that's a lot better. It's set up in a way where everything has a purpose and everything it works together to make something that all be a bit simple. Like I won't say that like my builds are like super complex or anything, but like I literally just said earlier, there's beauty and simplicity. There's beauty and not trying too hard. It's actually, it's another reason why I don't like most 3D builds either. Light 3D? Sure. Maybe building something as like a background object with like a teleporter to like go inside it? Sure. You, you, you can make that look okay. But like so much 3D stuff, it, it just, it, it's needlessly complicated. It hurts my eyes, honestly. And I'm not saying it doesn't take talent. No, building a 3D build Trust me, there's a reason I don't build, like, there's another reason I don't build 3D, and it's because I don't know how. I'm bad at building 3D. And, in all honesty, that, I mean, that's fine. I have respect for people who do 3D builds, because I know it's tough as hell. I just, I don't like it. I think it looks bad. It's like, don't... I don't know. I guess almost like a takeaway is like, don't, don't get too hung up on complexity. It will just make it look worse. Like overshading is actually like, it's an issue I even used to deal with as well, like in my pixel art. And it wasn't until uh, when I started working on the texture pack again, they really started to scale back, especially the coloring. I used to use like five, six colors on some sprites, but like, I can't speak. Like five, six colors plus the outline. These stone slabs? Uh, what's it? They're, uh, they're four. Four colors. Four colors, not including the outline. And one of those is honestly just a brighter, uh, mini outline of sorts. It's using your, it's using what you have in more resourceful ways in order to get a lot more out of them. And as such, it'll look better. Made you do some silly stairs. Yeah, of course you remember that arc bungee. It was all of my sprites a year ago. Then of course there was also the oversimplified arc, and then I had to find a good balance between them, which is kind of what I have now. I think I've struck a good balance, and even then I don't even hate my like oversimple sprites. Those ones still have some charm to them, in my opinion. Um, and some of them actually look pretty damn good. Uh, like, I think I was onto something with Spectre, which is why I haven't changed the Spectre and why I don't plan on changing Spectre, uh, Spectre armor at any point. Because I think it looks fine with the simplicity. Uh, especially since it's so vibrant. It's meant to be vibrant. It's meant to pop. It's meant to be colorful. To stand out with the white on it. Like what you have right now? Thank you. 
Yeah, of course, you remember that arc too, Bungie. That arc was like a month ago. Not a month ago, that was like two months ago. Still. And there's definitely things I took away from the uh, oversimplified arc. I think probably my biggest takeaway is that um, I still hate how a lot of people do uh, outlines. Um, and because like it's it's a style of outline I used to do, right? Um, it's the Terraria style of outline where every color has one to two outlines. That's fair enough, but like, like, like what, what's it like? Look at this. Uh, let me switch to a different thing. Look, look at the skeleton. Every single color has its own outline, and even then, those colors could have highlight outlines too. I personally don't like that. <coughs> Goes right back into the whole overcomplicated thing. You don't need that many outline colors, in my opinion. I'll use one, maybe two outline colors. And that outline color, uh, the second outline color is usually just a lighter version of the first outline color I'm using for uh, uh, music for highlighting. Rabbit tricks are for kids. One, two, three, four, five. Six. 18. Wow. It's a lot of floors already. Who dareth ping me? All right, yeah, Thorben has his own series. I'm like, who is pinging me? Right, Thorben's doing his own one year one world series because he like started the entire damn thing. Because no, I'm not original. I steal people's ideas. Hell my, hell my most, some of my most popular videos are stolen ideas like uh, Terry Manhunt. Or, I guess they were my most popular videos. I've since taken them down. I have since taken down Terraria Manhunt because it had my dead name in it, and I don't want my dead name places. We do love stealing. No, it's really funny. I just won the entire rant about over complexity when um, the entire point of this series is to be overly complex with my mod list. Um, we're not going to think too hard about that. Okay, I'm going to build up. We go ahead and we build up all this, and then we can just uh, smart curse or the rest of it.
wish I eaten. Yeah, whatever. Just random thought just popped in my head. I probably should have eaten. I don't think I've eaten since like 8 a.m. I think I had like a sandwich. Hell, I don't even get. No, I think I had a sandwich. Pretty sure I had a sandwich. Whatever. I'm not that hungry. I can I, I can skip out on eating. It's not that big of a deal. I might, I might not. Nope, I'll try. No promises. I'm, I'm, go, I'm gonna be honest. I'll, I'll, I'll try. No promises. Um, because I'm going to be door dashing right after this. meals of your clients true uh we're not gonna talk about the fact that 99 of fast food is uh uh is like has a bunch of meat in it because you know of course it does That's why I would eat Taco Bell all the time. So I started, uh, I guess, like really looking into like certain, uh, in, into like certain issues across the world. And now I don't really eat any fast food anymore. Knowing who, uh, like knowing what companies they're under and whatnot. But that's besides the point. I, I'll try not to get extremely political or whatever. But yeah, there's probably people that know the conflict I'm talking about. It's funnily enough, actually, the reason I started seeking out um, the energy drinks that I get at Aldi now. Uh, that's a lot better than Monster, who um, has one of their, uh, who's one of their largest shareholders is Coke. Um, so I'd rather just shop at Aldi. It's not even like not even B twelve. What do you think is I actually think this actually has quite a little Ah, uh, you are mistaken. Yeah, no, I'm like Yeah, it's um like a whole political thing. Don't really want to get too much into it because um not exactly uh it's not exactly extremely popular to take the stance I kinda take on it all. Especially since um Especially knowing the stance that uh, the American government is on. So I won't bother talking about it too much. But maybe if I build up the courage, I'll talk about it. Oh, I'll, I'll, I'll talk more, I guess, like in detail on it in the future. I get more confidence in myself about it all. It true. Yeah. Like, I, I already get shit on enough by pieces of shit. Luckily, that, that, that slowed way down recently. But, like, you get what I mean. And it's like, I don't really want to start another fucking war or whatnot, especially considering how divisive it is. But, sh whatever. Jeez, and I think that all started because I randomly said I was I was uh, a little bit hungry. I am like 
be like, I could eat, but I'm also like afraid I'm gonna gain back all the weight I've been losing if I eat like anything. Uh, because I kind of hate the way I look in some scenarios. Um, but I, I'm, I'm not gonna dump the fact that I might possibly I'm not gonna say I have it, but I might possibly have developed some form of ED. I won't talk about that. I know that can be a little bit triggering, so I won't. I, I, I will drop the subject. I love unhealthy eating standards and unhealthy uh, stuff. I love like unhealthy social standards. Shit, I made this very depressing very fast. I am sorry. Guess my thoughts are just kind of starting to wander while I'm building. Especially knowing just how much I'm fucking building right now. I, I guess. I don't know, just kind of weird. Definitely a little bit weird, just kind of let my thoughts ramble on, but it's fine. It's whatever, I guess. I don't feel like a Terraria stream is the best place to talk about political conflicts and possible eating disorders, you know? Because it is a little bit of a weird place to talk about it. Like what's I'm trying to entertain people. I'm not trying to, you know, dump my problems on on YouTube chat right now. Let's see if it is or it isn't some of these stuff up is like these have to be covered and such. I know. I know. And I I don't know. I might text you about it later, Bungie. I might don't like expect it, but who knows? Yay, I love mental issues and the world's going to shit. I love borderline escapism into video games. Woo! Yeah, I know you are. Hey, Harvest Moon. Let's listen to that music. We listened to the Hollow theme long enough. Oh, come on. I don't get to listen to it. Do I have the Harvest? I think I have the Harvest Moon music box, actually. I do. There we go. Right. 
fuck off. Alright, let's count how many of these I have again, because I actually don't remember. One... Okay, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Seven more. So this is. I just gotta quickly place these. This is, uh, twenty-one. Welcome back, Kyle. So 21, 22. Four. Right, I'm gonna use the black spot. Three, six. Wow, I actually got very close to so just straight up like predicting it. Uh, there is gonna be so this is just weapons. This is just weapons and ammunition. Under it will be tools. To the left of it, will, uh, over here will be armor. Down here will be accessories. Then vanity. Then blocks and furniture. And then everything else will be over on the side by order of item ID. I feel that. Um, yeah, no, I, I, I'm sitting here. I, I knew this was going to be a lot of work. Like I said, it's a multiple month project. This one I'm not expecting to get done in one month like the bridge. And even then, that was, wasn't a good enough estimate because holy shit, that bridge took too long. It was like literally just two blocks off the, uh, the 27. What? Ugh. What? Yes, I'm streaming. Let's go. Look. Yeah, I, I I assumed seeing yeah, this you had texted. Then go poo. Did you see all the fridges? Yes, I did see all the fridges. Wasn't it funny? It, yeah, there I guess. Forty. I had to move them all. Well, too bad. Just that's not like a you problem. My legs hurt. I hurt. I love you. No, you don't. Go drown or something, I don't know. It's very good for your health. Yeah, I better be in per yeah. I mean, if I didn't do my math right, I'm gonna like scream. I'd be very sad if I don't have the right amount of math. But I'd be close either way. I have to get on a call to resolve some stuff. I don't like say it here, but is everything okay? Just like DM it to me. You have a good one. 
Yeah, the entire thing's gonna be one block off. I have to move everything. That that would suck. I guess finally I see it. Yep, you have a good one, Bungie, Bugnies, Boogle Knee. The stream is a little bit more to talk about than just uh, we built the hall. Uh, we did kill some jungle mimics, which was fun. Uh, yeah, we made a grass of bongos. What does that mean? You're so right. Wait a minute. You're so right. Okay, well, that's all of this set up properly. See ya. Yep, you have a good one. Uh, how many hours has it been? It's been two and a half. Okay, then. Oh boy. We still got time to burn then. On the bright side, that means we should get quite a little bit the way through. music boxes we're just, gonna, we're, we're just gonna stick with the underground hollow theme for now okay as well that's classic Okay, yeah, sure. Spawned literally directly in front of me. Thank you. Wow, I'm just probably not gonna have enough glass lamps for all this, am I? I did not expect to have to make more glass lamps of all things. Some of the 200. I 
once we're done putting all of this up, then we're gonna go through and we're going to... Uh, what's it called? Damn it. We sadly will not be able to milk this one as well. I am so sorry. I'm assuming Longbeard's no uh, no longer in chat, but uh, if he was, I'm sure he'd be very devastated here. We are not gonna be able to milk this mimic. wrong <laughs> yeah sadly the mimics will disappear upon death god damn it this one won anyway it gets to it gets to be unmilked A little carnival <laughs> Yeah, I didn't expect you to still be here, I'm gonna be honest. Just the... the... Just the tower. Just an absolute, like, behemoth. on the background is unmatched you know what that's fair and that's always that's always been something i've kind of you know strived for if nothing else i kind of want to be a place that's chill enough for you to just kind of keep me on in the background you know like if funny or like hype stuff happens i i, I said it before if funny or hype stuff happens it happens but like don't expect that while walking into a queen of the storm stream expect to chill because we do be chill at least we try to be chill. Some of us are a little bit feral. Looking at uh, people like you, Longbeard, I'm directly calling you out. Ice cold chill, exactly. I mean, my old username was the Frost Paladin. Or at least one of them was. waiting in bated breath for like probably like August when we finally get a place down an item frame inside of an item frame uh, because eventually that is going to happen we're gonna get to the furniture section and we're gonna have to place down an item frame inside of an item frame it'll be very funny Hundred percent remember what the hell we were talking about, but yeah. Oh right, item frame. Yeah, item frame and item frame. Yes. I will relish the day that, that happens. Why am I not just sitting in the? Why am I not just sitting in the funny ship?
these cannons. Look at that tower! Expect the music to cut in and out a lot. I need to go back and forth. Or honestly, I can just open up my phone. Where's my phone? There's my phone. Let me plug this in as well before I forget. Do not take me to the Phantom Wiki. Fuck you. Fuck the Phantom Wiki. I forgot I don't have Indie Wiki Buddy on this, so I don't automatically get redirected. Let's start Rod. Staff. B-A-N-A. Banana ring. Bat bat. Bat scepter. Whoop! You see, there's a lot of bat stuff. There actually is not a lot of bat stuff. Beam sword. Gun. The keeper. Beanades are indeed considered ranged weapons. They're just ranged consumables. Betsy's Wrath. Wrath. Blade Staff. Bladed Glove. Blade Tongue. Lizard staff. Blood butcherer. I uh, don't die or something. Yep. Let's help it out. Blood rainbow, because we skipped the blood lust cluster. Blood thorn. Okay, we skip blood water because blood water is considered a typeless weapon so we are skipping it for this bloody machete blow gun blow pipe Saber. Oh, we skip bomb, we skip bomb fish, we go to bone. Bone. Javelin. Oh, 
bone pickaxe. Nope, we skip bone pickaxe. Never mind. Bone sword on the other hand. Bone throwing knife. Book of skulls. Stick. Oriole wood bow. Oriole wood sword. Bounty grenade. Brand of the Inferno. Breaker Blade. The fucking Breathing Reed. Actually, is the Breathing Reed considered to be a melee weapon? When in doubt, check the wiki. Melee weapons. Let me make sure that grenades, yes, okay, grenades and bones and all that do count. For that, what about list of melee weapons? Yes, okay, the breathing reed does count. Seems to be anything that doesn't have like a pickaxe, axe, or hammer power. <sighs> so yes, the breathing reed is indeed considered to be a weapon. And that is weapon number 54. Breathing reed. Bubble gun. Bunny cannon. Butcher's Chainsaw in here. It is not. Now we got a Cactus Sword. Oh, hello. Gun, cactus sword, cane, cane sword. I mean, cane, cane sword right there just ensures we're never gonna get this finished until like for quite a while. You're kidding me. Why are there so many of these shits? We definitely gotta change out this ability. Okay. 
Why are there so many of them? I'm literally around a peace candle. The significantly cooler celebration mark two. Cannon a Chic a Glorified Claymore this One is Glorified Saber God damn it get out of here Leave me the fuck alone! Normally I'd bitch about the aluminum hook, but actually right now I could use a cooler looking hook. I know that's kind of weird to say, but I just don't like the look. I just don't like the look of the fungal hook. No, I'm just staying, I'm just staying in my armor. Cheek, Chlorified Claymore. Next up should be Chlorified Saber. That would glorify partisan, right? And it's a glorified saber. Glorified shot bow. Hey, potato. We're currently naming every single weapon, every single vanilla weapon right now. Christmas tree sword. Not getting that one for a while. Icy cane. Twin year staff. Clockwork. Salt rifle. Ball to Naginata. Cobalt Sword. Third one. Third two. Third 
coin gun. Sword. Next up should be a skip copper bow. Hello, Jack. Um, not much is up right now. We are currently uh, naming all the uh, naming all the weapons for the gallery I'm making of every single vanilla item. Why exactly am I doing this? Because it's really funny. Also, because I, I kind of want it. I kind of... It's something cool to do. And it's something to really show the dedication put into this world, you know? What a cooler way to show your dedication. God damn it. Not again. Damn it! Oh my god! Mm. With all due respect, shut the fuck up, Asphodine. Not in the fucking mood. Mimic moment. Shut up. Literally SMH. But yes, mimic moment. I fucking hate mimics so much. Like, bitch, I am just trying to play the video game. I am just trying to type names on the signs. Yo, Curse Flames reference? Hey yo, they uh, Curse Flames became so popular they made him into a weapon. Cutlass. Oh hey, here's one I can put in right now because there's so many fucking hollow mimics. God damn it, I accidentally put it away. Never mind. We do not have a Daedalus Storm Bow on me. Oh boy, the Dao of Pal. Totally excited to make one of those. Dark Harvest. Dark Lance. Dart Pistol. AOing me for dart rifle, daybreak, at least fear staff. Death sickle. Yeah, curse one. Yeah. Sorry, I'm very tired perpetually. The demon scythe. Desert tiger staff. Diamond staff.
crippler crippler because we skip Drax. Gurndal. Evan Wood Bow. Pretty obviously after the Evan Wood Bow comes the Evan Wood Sword. the cannon oh, the fucking flies in it great wasn't this just fucking peachy okay genocide time Murder all the fucking flies so I don't have to deal with confusion. Okay. Egg cannon. Electrosphere launcher. Elf melter. Staff. Enchanted boomerang. The fuck off! Oh my god! Calm down, Rachel. Holy shit. Fargo, fuck you. I understand why you did this. Fuck you, Fargo. I think this is the first time I've ever actually, like, kind of bitched about the fact we aren't able to progress right now because this is extremely annoying. Right? Oh my god, and this is with the calming cry on. Look, 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 for proof. It just deactivated. I reactivate it right now. This is with the enemy spawns lowered. What the hell did Fargo do to the battle cry? He ruined it. I actually haven't I wonder if they have a better uh not gonna talk about the common cry Fargo's wiki does not talk about the common cry got it So I, I, want, I want the stat. How much is it supposed to decrease spawn rates right now? I'm curious, how much of a difference does this make? Or does it just not work? The enemy count did not just go down. No, okay, it's still hovering around the same amount. What the fuck? I'm so confused right now. Maybe it's because they're easier. Is there a spawn rates thing? I'm really not seeing too much of a difference.
it would open the fucking wiki page even directly through this. But by the time I beat Moon Lord, this will be better. Close of Trap Rod. Close of Trap Staff. Staff. Firecracker. Player. Dude, fuck off! Oh my god, please tell me I can craft some potions. Give myself knockback resistance with some potions. Flare on. Flamerang. Flamber's cane. Burst Rod, Flame Burst Staff, Do not do flesh grinder. Flintlock. There we go. Flintlock pistol. Flint staff. Flower of fire. Frost. Mm. 
flower pal. Flying dragon. Oh my god, I hate the fucking underground hollows so much. Hey, look, with how many fucking hollow enemies there are, we can already put this one up. I don't even need to look because this is so bullshit. Fly me all. Oh my god, please! Ugh, I'm not having a good time today. It, it is not my day. It's just not my day. Fucking Christ, I was looking down over at the fucking thing. Whatever. Fruitcake Chakram. Gatligator. Ghastly Glaive. Gladius. Gold bow. Broadsword. Gold short sword. Golden shower. Zappinator. Green phase blade. Green phase saber. Grenade. Grenade launcher. Hello, jousting lance. Hello, repeater. Peter and Bat. Like a fucking like zombie right now. Holy shit. Happy grenade. Rep 
Cocoon. Heat Ray. Hellfire. Rolling Bow. Five Five. Hornet Staff. Only is a shootius. Ice Blade. Ice Boomerang. Ice Bow. For some reason is significantly stronger than the other ones. Though I guess there is also a uh, this is the ice rod. Something something aggressive bungee video. Ice sickle. Hehe <laughs> ha ha. A funny joke. Blue staff. Yeah. You're welcome. Inferno Fork. Influx Waver. Give this one second. I'm looking stuff up. It, it's not for the it's not for the stream. It's just something unrelated that just popped in my head. And if I don't think it, I can give it right now. Great, I guess I'm not finding any issues. I guess I'm not finding any answers on what I was looking for. Jousting Lance. A Lightoscope. Tana. E Brands. Wait, holy shit, we're already on K? Wait, holy shit, that's layer 10! Oh my god, I didn't even realize. Wow, we're like. 
actually kind of chugging along. We're chugging along right now. Holy shit. Hell yeah. Laser rifle. The last prism. Lead bow. Broadsword. Short sword. Leaf blower. Other whip. Oh god, that is a small ass mimic, but okay. Whip, life drain, light disc, light spain, lightning or a cane, lightning or a rod. Lightning or a staff. Hmm. I'm assuming Lucy the Axe is not considered a melee weapon because the Butcher's Chainsaw wasn't, so I'm gonna just skip it. Lunar Portal Staff. Actually, I should probably check. I don't see why it would be. Yeah, Lucy is not. Okay, uh, I did a little bit more digging into what the hell I was looking for uh, earlier, whatever. Um, probably not be doing that on stream. Probably not, uh, whatever. Magic dagger, magic missile, magical harp. I always thought it was just magic harp. Huh. Magnet sphere. Blaze. Mandible blade. Marrow. Medusa head. Mega shark. Then we're gonna do like a Pokemon style rap, like uh, like the like the old Pokey raps from uh, 
uh, season one of the anime. So I was gonna do this, but for all these weapons. Molotov Cocktail Molten Fury Morning Star Muramasa Mushroom Spear Musket Mithril Halberd Mithril Repeater Mithril Sword Ooh. Nail gun Nebula Octanum Nebula Blaze Nettle Burst Knight's Edge Almost typed in Knight's to Sedge Knight's Sex Knight's Sex Ayo Kinda like that uh, Knight's Edge kinda caps off uh, its own row That's kinda cool Plus it uh, starts the row with another iconic weapon uh, The Mega Shark Nimbus Rod. Get yeah, AO. North Pole. Obsidian Swordfish. Onyx Blaster. Optic Staff. Orange Phase Blade Orange Phase Saber Orange Zappinator Calcum Halberd Orichalcum Repeater Orichalcum Sword Ah uh, yes, the Orichalcum Sword next to a weapon of equal value The Paintball Gun And then that sandwich in between that, uh you know, The Orichalcum Sword and the fucking Paladin's Hammer <laughs> And then that is, uh, sandwich between The Palladium Weapons My favorite weapons of mass destruction, the paintball gun. Palladium repeater. Palladium sword. Palm wood bow and great, we're on another wood type. How far are we? That's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Ooh, we're over halfway done. We hit the halfway point. We could get all of these weapons labeled by the end of the stream. Ooh. 
who dareth ping me? Don't write cast. Those like streams. Ah, uh, right, right, right. Um, onward bow. Um, wood sword. Then we go right into pearl wood. And then, like, legitimately, a, a, for some reason, if you, uh, for, for some reason, they made uh, the pearl wood sword. The pearl wood sword can out DPS Knight's Edge. Knight's Edge obviously edges out because it's got better range. Um, it, it's just like more consistent. But like, the Pearlwood Sword legitimately has Knight's Edge DPS on a on a fucking Pearlwood Sword because they wanted to make it good. It was actually it's a good alternate to, uh it's a good alternate to knight's edge if you don't want to go down that route like really early hard mode obviously replace it with the what like obviously you're gonna still replace it really quickly but like but but like it's really good phoenix blaster piranha gun Another weapon they made really good uh, somewhat recently. I mean, they did that like all the way back in like 1.4.1, I think, if not just straight up 1.4, but they gave it three piranhas and that made it pretty damn good. Platinum, bro uh, platinum bow. Platinum broadsword. Platinum short sword. Poison staff. Poisoned knife. I, I'm gonna be honest, I always feel like the pulse bow feels like a weapon that got removed in 1.3. Like, it could be because of the fact that it was my it was one of my two main weapons alongside the uh I guess one of my main three alongside the Terrorblade and the Horseman's Blade back when I played on console in 1.2. But like the pulse bow feels like a weapon that got removed. It feels like a weapon that got removed in 1.3, but it's not, it's still there. It's apparently not bad. Yeah, purple cloverfish. I know, right? You'll you like never see it. Like it's like rare even among like the rare weapons in terms of like, like it's like un it's like not commonly used even like among like the not commonly used weapons. It's weird. Uh, nope, almost did pwn hammer. It's the pygmy stack. Quad barrel shotgun. Queen spider staff. Rainbow crystal staff. Rainbow Rod, Rally, 
Raven Staff. Razor Blade. Typhoon. Razor Pine. Red Blade. Uh, yeah, Flaze Blade. Red Phase Blade. Red Phase Saber. Red Rider. Red Throw. Ooh boy, the Resonant Scepter. That could be a fun one to get. Just because we all know the princess is so fun to get. So this is 419. Revolver. Rich mahogany bow. Rich mahogany sword. Rich. Nope, it just goes right to the rocket launcher. I don't know why I thought there was a third weapon. Skip Rockfish, because that's a tool. It's a good weapon, but it's a tool. I'm gonna make the wild assumption of the Roman candle. Actually, the Roman candle might be in here. Let's uh let's see. Is the Roman candle? Oh shit! Ah. Wow, console area, it, it, it covers a lot more than I thought it did. So yeah, we'll put, well, we'll put the Roman candle in there. Rotten egg. Ruby staff. Fucking ruler, because that's a weapon. S D M G. It is imperative to put down the periods for the acronym because that's the only reason it's before everything else. Fan gun. Penguin staff. Sapphire staff. Scourge of the Corruptor. It's poor Corruptor. Needler. Sergeant United Shield. Shade Wood Bow. Sword. Shadow Jousting Lance. Shadow Beam Staff. Shadow Plane. Shadow Flame Hex Doll. Shadow Flame Knife. Sharanga, Sharanga, Sharanga. Yeah, of course they. Gun. 
Boomerang. Shuriken. Shuriken. Shuriken? I don't... But Shuriken. I wonder if the si Is the sickle on that list of melee weapons? It is. Oh, would you look at that? <laughs> okay, um, doing something really quick. I need, to get, I need to like actually you know stream on my stream almost like I'm like supposed to be doing things silver bow silver board sword I got British there short sword guy dragon's fury Sky Fracture. I remember back when Sky Fracture was everywhere. I haven't seen Sky Fracture in a while. Cool weapon though. I used it on one of my mage playthroughs. Like one of the first times I ever bothered to like do an entire uh, master mode uh, expert or master mode mage playthrough because I typically just play melee. Because I'm so obsessed with this class. Because I'm autistic as fuck and love uh, sword. I like sword. I uh, I can bring I can sum up my entire um, love and addiction to uh, you know, like love and special interest of medieval weaponry and like medieval fantasy with uh, me like sword. Paper rifle. Snowball, snowball cannon, snowman cannon, Over eruption. Ah, uh, yes, the solar eruption next to its uh, equally as powerful brother. The space gun! Carrier of pre-hard mode noobs. And destroyer of walls of flesh. Spider staff. Spiky ball. Final tap. To be honest, chat, as soon as I'm done with this, uh, as soon as I'm done, uh, 
typing up all these names, I'm going the fuck. The, like, I'm going and I'm going to end stream. Yeah, Staffer Regarth is on the list of melee weapons. That makes enough sense, I guess. They literally put a question mark in the fucking title. Staff of the Frost Hydra. Another weapon I never see. I swear, I need to do a playthrough of some of these. I actually have a hardcore playthrough. I'm, I started today in the background just to kind of, you know, give me something for my hands to do while I'm bored during the day. You know, just kind of like, like vibe in, but like, what's it called? Um, the, I can't they speak. Like, it could be cool to try out some, like, uh, I guess, like, less used weapons. But since I don't have, like, a class I'm really going to stick to, most likely. Like, I've been really enjoying the multi-class lifestyle, I'm going to be honest. Even if I do still primarily use, uh, melee weapons, I like the flexibility of, uh, doing other stuff. This is not really like full multi-class stats in hard mode. Like, I love, um, like their dedication to, uh, what's it? I love how they are like dedicated to, um, whatever it's called. Like I, I love I love their like commitment to having like different playstyles and whatnot with like uh even like primarily like the old ones army buffs and whatnot. I just I wish that there was um I wish there was like uh why can't they speak? Uh I I wish there was uh like more full multi-class set. Like, let me look at the list of armor. Because I, like, legitimately can't think of any in hard mode that are, like, full... that are, like, full multi-class. Yeah, spider armor summon. Okay, there's pearl wood armor technically. Oh right, crystal assassin. Right. Holy shit, I forgot about crystal assassin. That seems to be the only one. But there is crystal assassin. No, I'm I'm talking like all four classes. Like, full multi-class armor. I'm not saying that there isn't, you know, stuff that's like... Yeah, stuff that buffs all four classes. Um, in hard mode, it's only Crystal Assassin. I wish there was one that was post-Plantera or post-Golem. So you could really do an entire playthrough of like full multi-class, but it's not the end of the world. Also, also, I love that there is so many tools for each of the lunar stuff, right? So if we include unobtainable items, which actually we can get in um this in this playthrough due to uh. Uh, which we we can get in this playthrough due to um miscellanaria. There's the start of, uh there's the axe, the chainsaw, the drill, the hand axe, the hammer, and the pickaxe. That is six tools per lunar fragment. It's absurd. Starlight. 
third two. Storm Spear. Stylish Scissors. Stinger. Fun Fury. Uh, superstar shooter. Stupid, more like stupid star shooter. Oh, oh. Swordfish. Shotgun. Zam indeed. The staff, tendon bow, tentacle spike, para blade, para grim. Love that. Legitimately kind of busted weapon. The Aya Chithulu. Okay, the Horseman's Blade. The Meat Bowl. And all the way down to the T's. Probably where a lot of stuff is because a lot of stuff. Never mind, we've already gone through everything that had the, the that has the in the front of the name. The Undertaker. Behold, it's the Underminer from Incredibles. Not Incredibles 2 though, we don't talk about Incredibles 2. I actually never saw Incredibles 2, I just heard it was kind of mid. I'm gonna make fun of uh, the Incredibles 2 even though I've never seen it. <laughs> Imagine me mid. Thunder Zapper. Chain Axe. Nope, never mind. That was not meant to be a Tin Axe. It was meant to be a Tin Bow. I, I, I ended up catching it when I was going to go type in Tin Bow for the Tin Broadsword. Caught it, just typed in. Yes, Tim Schrott Sword. Photoshop that. Wow! Titanium repeater. Titanium sword. First, uh, I think that's the first of the hard mode orders to have their spear come after the sword. Oh, I almost thought I missed something. But no, it's, it, it, it's the titanium trident. Zona, that's actually a weapon we can get. And we actually need it for Zenith, too. Thank you, Ponsalaria. I mean, it makes sense. Home of Infinite Wisdom. From Bagiri. Another weapon we can get. Topaz Staff. Toxic Flask. Toxicarp. Tragic Umbrella. Breathing Reed considered a weapon that probably is too. Uh, Trident. Trimerang. Yo! What's up? There. Oh! You didn't need to- Well, you're going to do it. Thank you, you didn't have to, but thank you! Oh, yeah. It's tofu and noodles, holy shit. Oh, 
Oh my god. That'll be one of my favorite dishes. When people say tofu is an autism safe food, they fucking mean it. Like, holy shit, I love tofu. Might not be saying the words out loud as much as I am. Now we're down. On the funny. We also wasn't really planning on really eating anymore today because I wasn't that hungry. But I will gladly eat tofu noodles. Austin Bow. Austin Short Sword. Trident Uzi Valkyrie yo yo we are on the V's holy shit we're in close Of course then we have all the uh all the projectiles and all the ammo. Staff, Penis Magnum, or as it's called in my texture pack, the Glockodile. Milethorn, Volcano, <clears throat> whole host of Vortex stuff. Only one that matters is the Vortex Beater. repeater what they should be able to get yep. waffles iron going to frosting Wand of Sparking. Wasp Gun. Oh, that is a...
walls, shit. Fucking shield, you piece of shit. Weather pain. Weather fucking pun. No, I legitimately think there is actually weapons for at least almost every single letter of the alphabet. Got a white face blade. White face saber. sword wooden yo-yo Assuming there isn't just a normal Zappinator. Yeah. Zenith, and then the last weapon of the group, the zombie arm. Now we have to move on to ammo. Rainbow Flare. Shimmer Flare. Musket Ball. Meteor shot. Crystal bullet. 
First bullet. Starfight bullet. Bullet. And a bullet. Party bullets. Mana bullet. Floating bullet. Golden bullet. Endless musket pouch. Illuminate bullet. Tungsten bullet, which is funnily enough the last one because it was just added really late for some reason. Wooden arrow. Flaming arrow. Unholy arrow. Jester's arrow. Hellfire arrow. Holy <clears throat> arrow. Arrow. Osprey arrow. Chlorophyte arrow. Icor arrow. Venom arrow. Really good opportunity to call this the bone marrow. Uh, to call bone arrows bone marrows. But no. Endless quiver. Luminite arrow. <clears throat> okay, which of these do we actually get? Spectral errors are, got, are uh, obtainable. Okay, Vulcan bolts are obtainable. Barely certain heart arrows. Yep. <laughs> Vulcan bolts. Hard arrow. Shimmer arrow. Rocket one. Rocket two. Rocket three. <clears throat> Rocket four. Bluster rocket one. Bluster rocket two. <coughs> Rye rocket. Wet rocket. Lava rocket. Honey rocket.
Infinity Nuke 1. Mini Nuke 2. Poison Dart. Crystal Darts. First darts. Take four darts. Or dart uh, seeds is uh, definitely one. Get bone because that was already marked. Stinger bolts. Candy corn. Explosive jack o lantern. Steak. And then the nail. Look at that. It fit perfectly. Oh boy. And we're only a minute off. We're only a minute late. Good, 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 good. And well, I mean, with that, not much I have to do other than say thank you all so much for watching. I'm not really going to go over everything else today, but you know, like, sub, comment. Thank you all for watching.